everybody in the black community have no choice but to talk about this. Everybody giving their perspective on this lady right here. Who is this woman? CBS own interviewer, Gail King. She is the right hand woman, probably secret lover to Oprah Winfrey. Uh, everybody is eating this woman up because of what she did last week. She had an interview with Lisa Leslie and she brought up Kobe Bryant's rape allegation situation that happened in 2013. That wasn't the time and place for her to bring that stuff up. And Lisa checked and said, I don't even want to talk about that right now. Like, we, the man just died. Why do we have to bring that up? Let me tell y'all my perspective. And then I'm going to talk about Snoop Dogg in a minute. The woman was out of line. She was wrong as two left. She was, but listen, the girl is a member of the Boulay. I've done videos talking about the Boulay and everything. Who is the Boulay? The Boulay is the black Illuminati or the black elitists. These are the, the members of, or you want to say, these are the rulers of the black celebrities. These are the people who put black celebrities on. Like if you want to get in Paul, if you want to get in, in entwined with the elites, you got to first join in with the Boulay. How do you get into the Boulay? This all starts with the college for fraternities, the Sigma Phi Cyphers, all that. Um... Kappas, all that stuff, all that mess is boule. So the boule, which is the black Illuminati, are designed to keep the black people down. You know, we talk so much about the man, but let me tell you something. The man appoints the black elitists, and they are always on TV to disintegrate black folk. So let me tell you something. Wanna, everybody want to talk about black on black crime? Well, the found the founding father of black on black crime is the boule. The boule is where that mess came from. Gail King is a product of the boule. She goes on TV to disintegrate black men. So that mess that she did, it caused a serious backlash. And it caused cats like Snoop Dogg to go on his Instagram page and disrespect her to the fullest now. My take on what he said, he had every right to say what he said, I don't agree with him calling her a B word, but he had every right to say what he had to say because she was just out of line. I told you, people in our community, we, so many of us, like we don't understand how the elites really run. First of all, they've been used by the devil, but people like Gail King, Oprah Winfrey, all these black elitists or whatever, they do what they do. They're being paid by the, the white supremacist agenda, being paid to push this uh, nonsense, to come on TV, say certain things, and what it do is a trigger effect. So, Snoop said what he had to say, and then everybody was like, all up in arms. Now, apparently, this girl's getting death threats, which I, don't, I, I highly doubt, but if she is, I don't recommend killing nobody. But the woman was wrong with Stu left you. The man just died. You don't talk like we're not even trying to bring up old out. Why are you bringing up old allegations? That's the wrong place and time. Don't even talk about that mess. So she receiving, she received what she got. You know what I'm saying? It's it's unfortunate. You know what I mean? But like I say, this is the black Illuminati. This is what they do. The boule. Y'all can say if y'all don't understand what the boule is, look it up. Look up Boulé and you see what I'm talking about. People like Gail King, people like Oprah, people like Jesse Jackson, people like Al Sharp, people like Tyler Perry. All these black elitists. You want to get Kevin Hart, Steve Harvey, a whole lot of hip-hop artists. Shoot. Snoop, yeah, Snoop checking one of his own fellow Boulé members. That's another story for another time. But this is what I'm talking about. The reason why she got the heat is because it's so much shucking and jiving going on in our community. And like I say, this is what we do. We get on TV, we say certain things, and then it's a trigger effect. You know what I mean? But anyway, y'all hit me up in the comment section. I even did a video talking about why we should stop cursing and using the B word. Well, using curse words all in general. But... Like I say, Snoop Dogg had every right to go in. Then there's some other girl, some Susan Rice clown or something. She started to come at uh, Snoop Dogg talking about she going to do something. Like, it's just, just stupid. But, you know, this is what the elite do. They send out their little dogs, their lab dogs. And 
cause all kind of drama, you know, because at the end of the day, it's all drama. But anyway, man, I'll let you boy.